Hello and welcome to this video tutorial from computergargar.com and in this video we are going to look at how to round time values to the nearest 15 minutes. So I released a video the other day looking at rounding times into specific intervals and that was using the floor function. So it was always rounding down to be within that interval, that section of time. But maybe you want to round it to the nearest minute. So, for example, the nearest 15 minute interval. Maybe that is what you need. For example, if we're talking about 21 minutes, then that would be rounded down to 15 minutes. But if we're talking about 28 minutes, that should be rounded up to 30 minutes. That is, that is the next, you know, that is the nearest 15 minutes. That's what we're looking at. And to do this, we are going to have to use the M round function. So I've got a bunch of times here, a lot of times, over 5,000 times. But it doesn't really matter how many there are. And I'm going to enter the M round function. Let me just zoom this cell in even more, just so you guys can see exactly what's going on. And the M round function will round a number to a desired multiple. But it will round it up or down, depending you know, what is necessary, depending on the value. Now, the number in question here that it prompts me for is the time value. When I put my comma, it wants the multiple. Now, for this, we're going to use the time function to make sure that we are specifying it as a time value. That's now going to prompt me for the hour, minute and second. The hour is zero. The minute is 15. And a second is zero. Two closing brackets there, one for that time function, one for M round. So I'm specifying with the time function there that I'm interested in 15 minute, uh, what do they call it, 15 minute multiples of the time that I provide. So when I press enter and copy that to the bottom, we won't have to scroll down too long to see this effect take place. And here we have it. So at a time of six minutes 53, that is still round down to zero, but 8 minutes 29 is now nearer to the next 15 minutes, so it rounds it to 15. If we go a little bit further here, we can see this taking place again, I'm sure. Here we go. Good example there with 22 minutes 26 being rounded down to 15, but in 22 minutes 30, right on it, we are rounded up to 30 minutes, as that is the next multiple of 15 minutes. So that is how by using the M round function we can group or kind of round times to that nearest multiple, the nearest 15 minutes in this example. But bear in mind that this can easily be adapted if you wanted it to the nearest hour or the nearest 30 minutes. Whatever you may need, you just tweak the, the minute value or indeed the hour value of the time function m round and you will get what you want i hope you found that video useful please check out some of our other videos on our youtube channel and come check us out at computergaga.com